Oh, there's more spider sacks. Um. Spiderling, keep your eyes open. Where? I don't know where. Um, let me let me just let me just do this here real quick before I fall. Yeah! Oh, <laughs> oh, I can't go back. It is a one-way thing. Well, that's unfortunate. I'm kind of used to the wild heart zipline that allows you to go both directions. Wait, what? Hold on, can I break the game here? Can I break the game? Nope, you fall through it. Never mind, I thought I could walk on the zipline for a moment. <laughs> that would be amazing if you could, though. Um, I'd rather not fall. If I'm going to be 100% honest. Also, thank goodness it's daytime again. Because now I can see, and my torch is almost gone. Uh... I'm not going to destroy these egg sacks. There's no point. My well... Oh no, all my weevil wheat is going to expire here. That's not good. Is that another... Is there another zip line there? It said that there were spiderlings nearby, but I didn't see any more of them. I want to get up there. Thankfully, these things don't just kind of like burst open on their own when you kind of walk near them. You do actually have to attack them. Oh, I think I'm going to be out of meat here. What is this? Ooh. Raw science vat burst open. Science. Bug juice. Cool. What's gonna be in here? What is that? What are you? Sticky boost juice. Dope, I guess. I don't know. Let me drink don't this. Need to boil it. Ooh. For so long I have felt taunted by the spiders of the yard. Climbing, crawling, skittering with the greatest of ease. Oh, and how they delight in violating my workspace. I can't take a single step without getting stuck in their confounded webbing. I'm wasting daylight running, climbing, surviving, traversing this broken lab. The entire yard, for that matter, has become untenable. But perhaps my spider friends hold the key to my problems. Spider infestation. Um, how are the spiders going to hold the key to your problems? Is he going to try and, like, get a spider to work for him? And, like, be on his side? <gasps> I thought I fell. <sighs> Give me that science. I absolutely thought I fell. Um. Oh, this might be a mistake. Ow, my ankles. Shoot, that was raw! Okay. Mm. Mistakes were made, but that's fine. Yo, now that it's daytime, check out the yard. Oh my god, we can see how many- Oh my god, there's so many- <laughs> There's so many gnats! What the heck, dude? There are so many gnats! We got the tulips? I want to go there, dude. I want to know what that- It's a crow. Well, hello. I want to know what the heck is over here with all of these tulips. And what- Is that an engine from a lawnmower? And then there's like a lamp looking thing right there. Hard to say. Hard to say. Also, gosh darn it, these freaking things here are blocking my view of the rest of the yard over that way, so I can't really see much in that direction. So cool. Just the yard in all of its glory. Oh wait, can we see what's over there now? It looks like a toy castle. 
with like a thing on top, like a slime castle toy thing. But I'm not sure. Are you raw? Do I have anything that's cooked? Oh. The omelets are going to start going bad, it looks like. Alright, well how the heck do I get back up to the other thing? Is my question at this point. Actually, how do I get down? Mmm, that's one I never really thought about. How do I get down from here? Without dying. <laughs> that's the main question. Without dying, because I have stuff that I really, really do want to take back. Uh, I did see... What the fuck? Are you just... Cool. Just standing there. Awesome. Thank you for that, I guess. <gasps> oh, God. <laughs> oh, heights. Why? Why did it have to be heights? I mean, it's really cool. It's really neat. But good God, why did it have to be heights? How do I get over there? Wait a minute. How do I get over there? I have questions. But do we have answers? It looks like we have it. Answers. I thought that was a spider. Oh my god, my blood ran cold. Yeah, here we go. This might be how we get down. I would imagine. Dude, that was amazing. Very well done. Will that roll off? Yep, definitely will. Um, there's a spiderling running around here. Oh, there's two of them. Come on, you can do it. What you got? Barbarian mutation detected. I don't know how I feel about that one. But yo, it's the Flingman. Duel! I didn't even see you and I just blocked instinctively. It's the Flingman that he was talking about that was... I'm going up there. <laughs> that was like ruining his experiments and stuff. Supreme schematic. Oh boy, here we go. Also, there's probably gonna be a spider in here. I'll guarantee it. It's gonna be a big. I got the science. Can I have like a flare to like shoot in there and then run for my life? Oh, sound. Why? Oh, I hate this place. But I really want to know. I'm very curious. No. If I die, I'm gonna be upset. But it will. Taking a look. Um. I don't know what these are. That one looks like a spider, but I can't peep it. I can't tell if it's dead. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me do a thing real quick. Let me save. And let me eat one of my omelets. Mm. Not bad. Oh, the omelet didn't get me health. Oh, fuck. Oh no, it's an ant. I'm s I've been quiet because I just I'm 
fucking terrified. Show. This strikes me as like a boss encounter and I fucking don't want to. I'm not ready for this. I just want to see it. That's all I want. I just want to see it. But as soon as I step in this room, it's probably going to like descend from the heavens. Oh no. Oh boy, let me... Clean. Wish that was alcohol. Give me some liquid courage, but that's fine. Oh boy. I'm- I'm absolutely dead. <gasps> God damn it, I freaking tripped. What the heck? Why have I not found anything yet? <gasps> oh, fucking God. Okay. Dope. Whatever was supposed to be here is not showing itself yet, and it's scarier every single moment that it does not show itself. Oh, I hate it. My skin is actually crawling. God. Fucking itchy now. <laughs> fucking itchy now. Oh. Oh, no. Please don't do that. I'm gonna scream, and I'm sorry for your ears. Prematurely. Brood mother. I need to blow this up? I spy. You know what? I'm actually kind of happy that I can't fight this thing yet. It looks like I need a special thing. I need a thing to blow this up. Summon boss, yeah. I'm not ready for that. Good God, I found a freaking boss room. And I'm not ready for it, and I'm so happy that it's not active. Get me out of here. Oh my god. I hated every second of that. And I'm gonna hate fighting that thing even more. Dude, I didn't know that there would be bosses in this game. That's crazy! That's absolutely insane, mate. How do I get down from here? I still don't know. I'm still trying to get down from here. Stupid this way, maybe. Also, I love how confident I am now moving. Like, the height doesn't scare me anymore after that. <laughs> I'm not. Well, hello there. Ooh. I'm curious if I had enough spears or arrows. The fuck was that? What am I hearing? I'm hearing something mechanical and I don't know what it is. I'm curious if I had enough spears or arrows if I would be able to take that thing out from up here. I probably could actually. Oh. Nice lovely zip line. Ah, shit! Goddamn spiderlings. Oh, there's three of them. Oh, no. I'm out of stamina. Hold on. Wait, ceasefire. Ceasefire is ended. Do it. There we go. Oh, come on. I'm out of stamina again. Woohoohoo! Please, thank you. Good God. Give me those. 
Oh, is this his family? I don't see any of the kids that you could play as in there. What is this? Hedge lore. Hedge lord. Refreshing and nutritious lowers the rates of both hunger and thirst. Ooh. Today, Trudy asked, uh, or rather insisted, I take a break ah. from my work for a family day. I'll admit the argument that preceded my reluctant agreement was one for the ages. She just doesn't understand how important the work is. But in the end, all was not lost. As fate would have it, our little trip to Storm and Beaches Wave Park has given me fresh inspiration. Oh no. A particular attraction sported a zip line over an undulating pool oh. filled with sun-baked tubers. Basking in the light of the cruel sun that baked them like red, red raisins. <laughs> Jesus. But I digress. It was the zip line that captured my imagination. Such an elegant solution to my problems in the hedge. When we got home, it was straight back to work. After another argument, of course. <laughs> oh God, please don't do that. Dude, what the heck is all of this? There's another thing in there. Uh-oh. Uh, can I make that jump? <gasps> oh god, I thought I fell. Can I make that jump? Wait a minute, hold up, hold up, hold up. Will I die? If I do this. Also, it looks like that's the entrance right there. Shut up, crow! Battery? Mm, hold up, I don't think this is how I'm supposed to get down. Let me go back. I'm looking for the safe way down, but I don't really necessarily see one? I thought there- ooh. Yo, there's so much of this, like, stuff that's like broken bits. Is this the way down? Let me try it. Uh, that still looks pretty far. Shoot, I don't think I can get back up now. Uh, maybe I should have saved before I did this. Frick! Ow. Well, good news, we're alive. Initiate mixer overdrive. Quick swap mutation loadout. Uh, no, let me save because I'm alive. I don't know if I want to do this. This seems like it's going to start a fight. And I'm not ready for a fight with like almost no life. Oh, I'm back down here. Wait. I forgot I had those! Oh my god, I have two of them. I have daffodil tufts, and I could have used them to have a slow descent and actually- <gasps> ah, no! Frick, 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 frick! Help, I'm oh, you're kidding! Ow. Oh, uh, Not the poison saving throw! Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no. Now I'm dead. <laughs> Let me load that save. Because I don't feel like walking all the way back here. Alright, cool. Um. Let me take the long way around. Also, poison saving throw failed. That's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. I love how this kid... I don't love those sounds. I love how this kid is so nerdy. He's very relatable. Um. Ugh, I'm trapped. Can I actually walk? Oh no, I can't. I do have to attack out of it. But it does get me. 
Web Fiver. How do I... That's how. What is up here? Oh, they're fighting it. Don't you start attacking me. Go ahead, fight them. Yeah, I'm gonna let them fight each other. Are they actually damaging each other? I can't, well, it looks like it did. I can't tell if they're actually gonna damage each other. Ooh, there's a big boy. Um, you know, I think I'm gonna walk away from this one. I feel like walking away from this one is not a terrible idea. Now let's the of the last they killed it! I am getting ever closer to perfecting this space. <laughs> Raw science containment has been a success. At last measurement, we are within 0.2% translation accuracy, but those final infinitesimal bits have proven the most difficult. Despite that, Virgil and I have been able to transit the miniature world without incident. I must admit it has been a bit overwhelming of late. Between school, grading papers, nightly work in the yard, and this sweltering summer heat, I feel stretched thin. Some nights I find myself too exhausted to work on my experiments. All this is going to give me gray hairs. I mean, why just the other day, Trudy said that the stress is putting new wrinkles on my face. She may have a point about the hair, though. <laughs> as much as I'm loath to admit it, it does seem to be thinning. Perhaps it's time to dig out the Skeddy clamp and try it on myself. I'm sure it's in a bin or box around here somewhere. The, I'm sorry, the what? The Skeddy clamp? A little exhausted. Let me save again real quick. I want to activate this. What will this do? Two arms! Two arms! Oh, yep. Definitely have to fight. What am I going to be fighting, though? Oh, you're goddamn kidding. That's so many. Ow. Ow. Oh, I'm not ready for this. Oh, I don't think I'm ready for this. Oh, I'm not ready for this. Hold up. Actually, let me try that again, because I have spears. Yeah, there they are. There we go. Oh, I'm too exhausted. Hold on. Well, we can smack him now. There we go. Quickly, gather the spoils and rearm yourself. Oh my god, rearm yourself. Re. 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 rearm yourself. Re. oh my god, what the heck? Just give me it. Thank you. Oh, there's one over there. I don't think I have time to go grab it, though. Oh, are we going to get attacked again? I don't know. Oh, you're goddamn kidding. Two of them? Frick! Bro, these spears actually do quite a bit. Yo! Needs repairs. Well, that's unfortunate. How do I repair you? Wait, how would I repair it? Well, because I didn't know how to repair, how I would go about repairing it, I just reloaded so that way it's fine. Um, let me get out of here though, because, oh my gosh. Uh, I do need to get Octavite since things the, uh, at the field research places, if I'm not mistaken. Hey, Fit, how are you? <gasps> Are you kidding me? Get out of here with that. A freaking orb weaver. No, thank you. My god, dude.
Um... I might as well. I spy. Mark that one off the list. I've never killed a ladybug yet. I'm curious what you will get me. I'm also curious how they fight. They also look like they would be extremely armored. Let me just... Oh, they are extremely armored. Did it just heal? I'm sorry, did you just heal? Whoa, it tries to bash! Ooh, can I throw a spear in your face? Ooh, spears don't actually do a lot to you! Ooh, but we did stop you mid-charge with it. There we go. Oh, gods, no! Ooh, what's he gonna do? Nope! 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 Oh, you hurt! Ow, frick, dude. Oh, if we're not prepared for that charge. You really hurt. But we could take you down. What do you give us? Ladybug parts. And ladybug head. Interesting. Let me, let me regather all my spears. Oh, I'm full inventory wise. Well, spears are completely irreplaceable, so that's fine. I killed a ladybug, though! I'll have to analyze its parts and see what it gives me. And I don't know just where to analyze them at. Gets a chest plate, face plate, stuff ladybug, skin guards, and repair glue. Ooh. And a level up! What will the level up get us? Flip flops, bubble helmet, slime lantern. Dope. What's the head gonna give us? Is it just gonna give us the like impromptu prop? <gasps> Insect axe. Ooh, and ladybug mount. Ooh, those are nice. Yeah, this thing. The resource surveyor. Oh. Interesting. Um, where's something that I actually would want to know where it's at, though? It looks like I have to have found the thing. What if we do clay? Surveying for clay. Yo, look how much clay is over here. What if we do billy hog bites? Dude, it shows us where stuff is. We do acorns? Yeah. That's actually really cool. Flower petals. Barely any, actually. Glow goo. Iridescent scales. Some over there. Uh, I don't see the things that I... Oh, wow, we're really thirsty. Uh-oh. What? Orb weavers or what? Apparently something's on to me. Something knows I'm here. I'm about to freaking die of thirst. There's a smash berry, apparently. Uh, let me get out of here. And find some water. Because I'm about to die of thirst. There we go. Got myself a torch. Well, it's better than nothing. It's gonna hurt us. Or rather, it's gonna take our health, or not our health, our hunger down, but that's fine. Alright, I think it's time to go back home. We found a bunch of stuff. And if I can find more ladybugs, I wanna craft that new axe that we just unlocked. That seems like it would be very useful. Chop can. What? What am I finding? 
I was just trying to refill my water. I was just running back... Oh, chop can. I was just running back home, and I found a can. I found a field station. Where did I find a field station? Soda drop. Look. Your canteen is full. I want to drink it. There we go. Where's the field station that I found? Also, is it there like a small, very thin lining of plastic on the inside of soda cans? If I'm not mistaken. I feel like there is. Where is this field station? Oh, it's right here. Well, fancy that. And it's got a thing. I've thought about this in circles for days now, and I've come to a decision. It's time to restart spacer development. Almond may not believe in it, but I know its potential. Though I must figure out how to return shrunk objects to their original size. The first step will be to address the particle transcription errors. It seems almost certain that the irregularities are responsible for the failure during the demonstration. Burgle, please bring up all the lab data about the unknown particles. Happy to be of service. Notes will be prepared and delivered to your table in... Four hours or less. <laughs> four hours? What are the chances for less? Delivery estimate will be prepared in two hours or less. <laughs> An auspicious beginning. Dope. Um, what is this? Ooh. Fortified base pebble foundation. Stuff for building bases. Multi-story base? Oh, I don't have enough science for the pebble foundation. Well, shoot! Looks like I'm gonna need to find more science. That is one thing that I haven't really ever done uh, in this yet. What the heck? Is this the same one that I just found? Did I just walk in a circle? I think I did. But yeah, that's one thing I haven't done in this yet at all is build a base. I don't want to deal with mites! I don't want to deal with spiders either. Oh, frick. Time to run. Time to run. Oh, shoot. They follow me far, don't they? Wait, hold up. I just noticed the stuff that I unlocked went to the bottom of the screen. That went so far. I'm still being chased. What the heck, dude? That music cut out real quick. <laughs> yeah, that's one thing I have yet to be able to- uh, one yet- oh my god. That's one thing I have yet to do- oh, my meat spoiled- is build an actual, like, structured base. I literally just have this set up here, which, if we're honest, I started collecting more stuff. Because I want to build a base, but I also wanted to research the stuff first to actually build a proper base. And I'm gonna have to, like, scout around to see where I will want to then build subsequent base uh let me put my stuff away real quick all right uh what do i need to craft the axe yeah insect axe i need bombardier parts and silk rope how do i make silk rope Ooh. also bombardier parts that sounds like a terrible time Give me another torch, though. Repair tool, weevil shield! Can I make the dagger? No, I still need the... Mm, okay. A lantern made from slime mold. Useful for exploring the murky depths. Is it like an underwater light source? Probably. Eelgrass. Bro, what are all these things? the heck are all of these things a bubble helmet sunken bone Dude. is there gonna be more water monsters oh my gosh yo look at the ladybug resistance the ladybug armor is amazing i need berry leather which means i need the knife 
block strength, increased, as well as heavy armor. Bro, that's going to be amazing. What the heck are flip flops? Light armor, swim speed, dope. Oh, it's like the first level two armor set. Veteran Diver, just straight up heavy armor. Ooh, I can make meatloaf if I have aphid jerky. Get some gnat jerky. Boost juice, liquid gills, Veteran Diver, and it heals. Liquid rage, spider fangs. Fuzz on the rocks. Ooh, fuzz on the rocks is actually really easy to make. And it heals and gives max health. Ooh, I'm gonna have to stock up on a few of those. Ooh, oh my god, look at all this stuff. Bro, you could build like proper homes. Like, yo, you could actually build proper homes with all of this stuff. Tadpoles? Oh no, are there gonna be frogs in this as well? Yo, look at all of this awesome stuff! That's crazy! That's craziness. Um, take a gander at the smithy station. If I want to upgrade you, I still don't have what I need for it. But if I want to upgrade you, do I have to have it in my... Wait, what? Or do I... No, I have to make it, don't I? Hold on, wait a minute. I have to make a thing, don't I? Yeah, I have to make a thing. Okay. So I wonder if... Because you see, this insect axe, it's a level 2 axe. Whereas the pebble axe is a level 1 axe. So I wonder, even if I were to upgrade the pebble axe, if it still wouldn't be able to cut down level 2 stuff. So I wonder if there's even a reason in currently upgrading my armor set. Because this thing is a level 1 grub armor. It does give me a boost to maxed anima, which is extremely nice. And the main reason that I'm using the uh, clover helmet and shin guards still is because of how accessible they are to basically be able to be repaired. They're very easily repairable. But I don't really want to upgrade them necessarily. A look. You one for the beast Did I never scan it? I never scanned anything. Like, holy crap. There's so many things that I thought I had scanned, but I never actually scanned. Um, I need to do a thing. I need to make more storage. There is one thing that I really like about this game, and that is... You can craft stuff without having to have it pulled into your inventory. Which is extremely nice quality of life thing. Like, it's so nice. Can I repair you? Yeah, I just need larvae. Wait, what? Yeah. See, I don't have any larvae stuff in my, in my uh, inventory, but I can still repair this. Because I have it in nearby containers. It's a really nice quality of life thing. Like, exceedingly nice. I can make spider rope with the web fiber. Cool. That's good to know. And I know where to get more of that as well if I need it. What did I need it for? This. So I just need bombardier parts. That's all I'm going to need. Uh, let me start making them at least. Because it does take time to craft it. So it's kind of one of those things you craft it and then you walk away from it. What is happening? What is this? Sick. You drank some nasty... And need to, you drank something nasty to sleep it off. Drinking nasty things leads to an increasingly upset stomach. Oh. So I do have to sleep to get rid of that debuff, it would look like. Ooh. That's actually really good to know. Because now I really want to avoid drinking nasty water if I don't have to. 